Alright, so I'm sure you're all wondering why I gathered you here today. Before we get to that, I'll have to give you some background. See, when I was a little kid, I was an aspiring scientist. That's all I ever wanted in life, was to, was to be a scientist and wanted to just do everything with that. But where I came from, we didn't need any more. Everyone was a scientist. We didn't need some little kid to grow up wanting to be a scientist. Well, everyone was already one. So I ended up, I made a decision in my mind that I would leave and I would try to find someplace new. And I wanted to find someplace that would actually care about me and accept me for who I am. So if I would have stayed there, I would have just felt like a failure. So I decided to try to find someplace new, which is why I ended up leaving my first home to try to find my new home. And, it, and I ended up moving to the Bronx in New York in 1958, and where I let my, really left all my family behind to try to start over again, so I could basically follow my own dreams. And in 1991, I graduated from Harvard uh, University. I got my doctorate, so I could actually follow my dreams and become a scientist. And ever since then, I basically, um, I've inspired millions of people Millions of people also love me. I've got people to follow their dreams and do everything that they love. But to do that, I had to basically leave behind everything in the first place. I had to leave behind my family, everyone that cared about me, and everyone that was like me. But I did manage to become a scientist, so I succeeded. But I can no longer, I have to tell everyone the truth. I can no longer keep living a lie to all of you. Ever, like, ever since I got here, I've been slightly different than all of you. This speech is a lot shorter than I ended up wanting it to be. Which is why I need to tell all of you today that I, Neil deGrasse Tyson, am actually an alien. I left, <laughs> I left my home because no one accepted me for who I am because I wanted to be a scientist and everyone else was already a scientist. We didn't need anyone else because there was nothing left to really discover. So I ended up coming here so that I may follow my dreams and become a scientist and basically educate all of you what it is to me, like, uh, what it means to follow your dreams and to basically look up at the stars and wonder what's out there. Thank you.